guys, today I'm showing you guys this amazing, cute, stunning, phenomenal holiday limited collection from this Korean cosmetic brand called Appeal. Now, if you keep up with my hot new arrivals in Korean beauty series, beauty series, beauty series, um, I've talked about Appeal and their limited collection called Doraemon, which is uh, this little guy. It's from Japanese cartoon character. It's just so cute. Anyways, I thought it was over. And then the next week or the week after, they came out with a holiday collection of this Doraemon. So everything is just too cute. It's just so adorable. I just couldn't help myself. So I ran to the store and got myself a couple of things from the collection. So today in this video, I'm showing you guys all the stuff that I picked up and um, it, the exact names and uh, the online shops where you can get them. I'll put them all down in the description box. So definitely check that out. And also if you like this video, then don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. That is like like the biggest support for me and what else <laughs> oh also this makeup I uh, just finished filming a makeup tutorial for this like holiday inspired um, kind of like smoky makeup using all these products that I'm showing you guys today and this tutorial will be up this week so definitely be on the lookout for that all right so this is a holiday limited Doraemon collection from a pew and everything is just too adorable you guys the packagings are so cute that they have very affordable price points I swatched almost everything at the store and they are just fantastic I love everything about this collection I actually didn't really expect much from a pew and like a couple of you know months ago even I wasn't really interested in this brand called Appeal because you know they're kind of like lower end brand and I don't know I just did not think that they would make anything you know good quality but apparently everything is just really really awesome so first thing that I picked up oh it's it's definitely the star of the show is this palette it's a um, eyeshadow palette as you guys can see this is their um, just existing Doraemon this is actually limited collection as well just like this collection but this is just Doraemon and this is Doraemon holiday see the difference adorable it's just oh my gosh so this is what I picked up and um, they have two different eyeshadow palettes and mine is in make me glam very compact which is perfect for travel and uh, for just everyday uh, makeup pouch this is I think it's just perfect because it's really compact really slim and thin and it's not big see I kind of have a I kind of have large hands, but still, it is very small. I mean, not like very small, but it's like a really, really good size. And then when you open it up, you get a uh, pretty large sized mirror, which I really appreciate. And these are the shadows. They are beautiful. They have a couple of different textures, which I really appreciate because, um, I don't know, I like to mix different formulas, different, um, you know, textures. So they have shimmery finishes, they have matte finishes. I love to use this color right here as a crease color, as a transitioning color, and then use, you know, these like really shimmery ones as like an all over wash of color on the lids and then do the uh, outer corner with these like darker colors this palette is just awesome uh, it's definitely worth the money I mean it's how much was it I don't remember but it's not expensive it's great for the money and I'm going to show you guys the swatches so we're going to swatch from the very left all the way to the right. So starting from this color, they don't have in the visual color name. It's just a uh, Make Me Glam palette. So uh, this one right here. So it's a very, very smooth texture. It's a shimmery texture. Um, and so there. Can you guys see? Like the lighting is so bright 
and I don't think you guys can see but it's a very um ooh I just almost dropped it um it's a uh, beautiful champagne-ish shimmery color um it's not like a groundbreaking color so um I think it'd be great for um the brow bone and the inner tear duct highlight it's a beautiful color and then we have this one right here which I use today as a crease color a uh, transitioning color ooh that is beautiful hope you guys can see so that's like a um, slightly mauveish um, brownish color which is perfect for you know uh, crease color I love it so much it's like matte finish but it's not too matte where you cannot blend because it blends really really good so I highly recommend it for transitioning you know you know softening out color and then following up is this one right here which is pretty unique color it looks like a uh, very dark well brownish kind of like brick toned pink and let me swatch it for you so there um, it's like pinkish color, but it's not that Barbie pink. Uh, it's got that, you know, um, heavier, you know, deeper brownish kind of undertone to it. I think it's a beautiful color. It's definitely um, something you don't see every single day, and that's a fun color. I actually used, like, mixed these two together as a crease color today, and I freaking loved it. And then the one next to it is one of my faves from the palette. It's a beautiful, beautiful shimmery cranberry color. Oh my gosh, the pigmentation is awesome. All these, uh, all these like eyeshadows uh, swatch really good. They have very intense pigmentation, but the shimmery ones got extra strong pigmentation. I, I love it so much. And then the next color right here is like a... Uh, apricot-ish color which is a shimmery finish and this one is beautiful too Ooh, oh my gosh this totally reminds me of all that glitters from MAC it can be a perfect dupe for that um, it's, it's really really pretty uh, the the texture the finish is very smooth it goes on so softly and the color itself is just beautiful I mean everybody can pull all these colors off there's no you know not even one color that anybody cannot pull off because they're just so pretty and uh, they're just kind of like universal colors and then next up is this brown color this is a shimmery finish too which means see that see that Ooh, yes that is a beautiful color so that one is that brown one um again it's a shimmery finish it goes on so smooth and buttery but it's not uh crumbly so love that and then the one right next to it, this one right here, is a, uh, ooh, it's like satin taupey color. Love it. It's perfect for everyday makeup because it's not too over the top, yet it gives you dimension, it gives you depth, it just... You know, uh, it's one of those like really easy yet beautiful eyeshadow. So that one's um, again shimmery finish. And then the last one is this color, which is a dark brownish, but not exactly brownish because wow, look at that pigmentation. It's kind of like um, plummy grayish brown, if you know what I mean. It's got a uh, multiple colors mixed together I mean it's, it's just a beautiful gorgeous color uh, pretty self-explanatory so that one is the last one on the very right so these are all the colors from the palette I'm seriously I'm loving all these colors actually these two are matte finishes the rest are all shimmery colors they all uh, swatch really good have very high pigmentation to them so 
Okay, next up is this CC cushion. For those who don't know what CC cushion is, it's basically a foundation in a powder form, in a powder system. So it's really convenient and uh, it's really easy to carry around and everything, but I have been kind of on defense about CC cushions because I do not necessarily think they are hygienic, but I am kind of changing my mind. I'm like, I'm slowly really inter getting like interested in CC cushions and all types of cushions. So I am going to do a first impression on this cushion. So that is going to be a separate video. So I'm not going to show you guys everything, but I mean the packaging, first of all, is very adorable. I mean, there's not, I, I cannot think of other words to describe this packaging. It's just so adorable. So cute! I mean, come on. If this doesn't scream holiday, I don't know what does. So this is the CC cushion from the holiday collection. <sighs> yeah, and then when you open it up, there's a mirror. And then uh, here's a uh, cushion. You, you call this a cushion, uh, but it's basically a puff. But it's not just a regular puff, it's for foundation. And then there's a plastic uh, lid, like a separator. And then when you flip it up, there's a uh, cushion, not cushion, there's the, uh, there's foundation basically. So I am going to do a first impression. So if you're interested and if you're excited, then definitely give this video a thumbs up so I know uh, how many people you know, want to see uh, the first impression on this one. And for this particular product, you get a, um, the, uh, the cushion. And then you get a extra uh, this puff, and then you also get a um, another additional foundation refill as well. So it's a really really great deal, great value. I love it. And then lastly, I picked up two blushes from the collection, and you guys get ready because the packaging is just to die for. Yay! Oh my gosh! Look at this, like, so simple, yet so cute, and just, I mean, I love it. The only thing is, uh, it's a sticker, so it's not, like, exactly embossed, or it's not a, you know, it's not part of the container, it's just a sticker, but I don't think it's going to come off that easily. Um, I'm sure it's a pretty damn hardcore sticker, but, uh, you know, regardless, I really love this packaging, and I love this white container as well, you know? Alright, so, I believe they have, like, eight different colors available for the blushes. I don't know. And then, um... This one over here, it's a blush, but I use it as a bronzer because it's got a really nice uh, pigmentation to use as a bronzer, like as a soft bronzer. So this one is in color BR01, and this one is in CR01. So I believe CR represents coral and BR represents brown such an amazing colors and they are very smooth and most importantly they are very easy to blend there are you know some blushes and bronzers that will never blend out you know once you place it on your cheeks it's like there it won't go anywhere but these ones are very smooth very soft very easy to blend so I am loving everything about these blushes and I'm going to show you guys the swatches of these blushes as well so this is what the blush looks like adorable huh and it's in this beautiful white packaging I love it yay look at that look at that little monster it's so adorable is it a monster I mean is it a cat or bear I don't know anyways this one is in number CR01 I'm going to swatch it for you guys but right off the pan it looks beautiful it's a beautiful uh, apricot coral color Slightly peachy, but not too peachy. It's more like on the corally side. So that's the blush. It is, again, CR01. 
swatch like this, it may look a bit intense, but trust me, once you blend it out with a fluffy blush brush, it is gorgeous. It gives you that really nice natural flush of color, uh, which is just beautiful. Next up is this blush in BR01. It's part of their blush line, but I use it as a bronzer because as you can see, the color is um, is very, very you know nice for using as a bronzer. I use it as a preliminary bronzer. I contour with a darker uh, bronzing powder, but I use it as a soft bronzing one. So, I'm gonna swatch it. Very, very smooth, guys. So smooth. Oh my gosh. So, um, it doesn't have a red tint to it, which I highly, highly appreciate uh, because I have like olive yellow undertone to my skin already. So, I do not want anything, you know, red uh, in my bronzer. And this one does not have any red pigmentation to it. Uh, it's just a uh, light brown color. So, uh, use like a really big brush and just apply it as a bronzer. And it is just beautiful beautiful so that's it I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did because I mean I just cannot get enough of this cute little guy it just makes me feel so good I'm like every time I feel kind of unholiday ish I just you know whip it out and I'm like yes Christmas is just around the corner and I just you know pack it on my eyes <laughs> um, so as you guys all know, um, I have my own store at shopkoreanbeauty.com where I carry a lot of Korean beauty supplies. So if you're interested in some, you know, Korean beauty stuff, then definitely check it out. We offer, you know, coupon codes and there are really good deals and like, you know, uh, values and everything. So I'm pretty sure you guys will love it if you are a, uh, if you're interested in Korean beauty. And also, if you have anything uh, in particular that you want to purchase, then definitely let me know. Uh, leave a direct message on my Instagram or just message me. Uh, message me. Message me. Yeah. Message me <laughs> through my um, email. I'll put the address in the description box down below and also if you want me to do um, a first impression or some kind of review on any kind of you know Korean beauty products then definitely let me know as well all right we're almost mid-november and I'm so excited to go out and buy more stuff and just break my bank <laughs> so if you guys enjoyed this video definitely don't forget to thumbs it up and also please subscribe to my channel you guys have a nice fabulous day and i'll see you very soon in my next video